what it do you too slash patreon slash bit shoot today's video i want to change the video and i want to talk about earth energy part two yes i am sorry the video cut off on the first part i don't fucking know why but you know we're gonna finish it so like i was saying in the first video they could take a rat's head a dead rat they could take his head do some shit to it in the laboratory turn it into a potato nash produced that and put that shit in your grocery store and the thing about gmo right is and this is the thing this is the thing between gmo and gmo is technically science but you got man-made science and then you got actual biology natural science you know what i mean just spiritual natural because spirituality and science does go hand in hand but you got man-made science and again sometimes you got man-made spirituality like that commercial consciousness shit but basically right in nature right natural biology we know that in nature humans animals trees plants anything that shit anything that shit just um basically what it does is is everything has a flaw in it in nature and biology everything has a flaw everything has you know what i'm saying what the fuck that motherfuckers on some motherfuckers on some weird shit. I don't know. You already know how to be. You're not niggas. You put a level on some weird shit. But anyway, see, just some AT. I told you, see, I AA is trying to distract me. But anyway, everything in nature animal, humans, trees, plants, they all have a, some type of flaw in it because nothing is perfect, right? But when you have man made science, GMO foods, they try to make it as perfect as possible. So, like I said, those dead rats' heads or some shit like that, this is just an example. It don't even got to be that. It could be a fucking old carrot or something. They could turn that shit into some brand new carrots. Or they could take some shit. Dr. Emoto in Japan. Go check it out. He took feces out the sewer. Not probably physically out the sewer. But he got feces from the sewer. Put it in the laboratory. Turned it into steaks. Yeah. And this bin came out. Just like Dr. Emoto. He did the rice. Uh, he did the water. I think the water and the rice. Or just the water thing. But he took a, a glass of water. Labeled it said positive things to it every day took another glass of water labeled it bad energy or whatever said bad things to the other glass of water every day the bad glass of water every day he said something bad to it it ended up turning black after like a month or some shit like that and then with the positive glass of water that he spoke to positively every day it um it turned to like gold or some shit like that or like just like just um this powerful water like on a higher level higher frequency so that goes to show that words are frequencies words are spells it has energy behind it so it's the same thing but that's more of a i don't necessarily want to say it's like a, a man-made thing but it's like 50 50 it's like a natural and man-made thing because at one point in time fucking what millions of years ago or some shit we had we, just, we only spoke in telepathy we didn't speak in words you know what i mean but that's a whole different story. But anyway, they gonna sell these potatoes, these GMO potatoes or apples or whatever. The motherfuckers gonna look so beautiful in the grocery store. That's not real. If you see a real potato, it got dents in it. Sometimes they got cuts, bruises. You see apples and shit, they're not always perfect. Sometimes they got little holes in them from worms trying to get in them. Or they might fail, they got bruised. Same thing with oranges, bananas, all that shit. You never see them perfect. You see perfect fruit in the grocery store, that is GMO poison. That they want to put in your body so it can change the mo molecular structure of your chemical compounds. You better wake the damn up. This is not a game. This is not a joke. You know what I mean? Real shit. And as I'm speaking of this, look what look what comes fast. Just poison.